Welcome back! Um, yeah, so a lot of you guys have been requesting for me to do a lot of pickup videos. Um, I haven't been having the time to get to that because I'm just trying to introduce all of you to, um, you know, the milk product videos and so forth and so whatever. Um, you know, just trying to drill that name into your head, you know, milk this, milk that. And, um, yeah, so I'm getting back to that, to the whole pickup situation, and which is good because I've been back in New York for quite some time now and um I'm still packed like I I haven't unpacked anything it's still sitting around I have a luggage here um that is solely everything that I've purchased from Hong Kong um that I was meaning to show you guys but I really haven't had the time to get to it so this is the perfect opportunity for me to do so um yeah so I hope I can get this video through and I can just start putting away my luggages of some sort. It's, it's just been nuts. Um, so yeah, first off, this hoodie that I'm wearing, this wasn't from Hong Kong, don't get me wrong, but it is a recent purchase. Um, everybody needs a red hoodie, like especially a red hoodie that's classic or whatnot. So I actually picked mine up from um, Abercrombie & Fitch. I know a lot of you think that it's just a preppy, br well actually a preppy brand, but um... Aside from the fact, like, I don't wear it the way that they market it to wear. Um, it's very classic, all-American, so forth, yada, yada. But I tend to wear it with um, a little of my own twist, you know, with my style. So this is with the white ropes. Um, and it specifically has to be white ropes. Like, um, that's just my thing. So it's um, New York, Fitch. And the reason why I love them so much as a company is that their quality is amazing. It's super soft, super ridiculously soft, and that's what I love about my clothes and the fact that it keeps its shape time after time after time after time. And they keep producing items with such quality that things that I've owned ever since like high school, they still look amazing. Um, so yeah, that is another reason why I love this brand. So this is what it looks like. It's a super soft brush cotton, patch letters, a and F Fitch running down the left sleeve. And then you have your classic, um, you know, rugby-ish kind of patch or whatnot. And you have a nice, like, gray lining for the hood, inside the hood. And it's chunky. I love chunky hoods. And that's mainly um, another thing about great hoodies is that the hood has to be chunky and it has to stand on its own. Um, I personally do not like hoodies where the hoods kind of flop back and it's kind of flat or what. I, I'm very, you know, anal retentive about certain things, so this is one of my favorite hoodies. Moving on! We stick with A&F, uh, I guess, since we're talking about it. Recently picked up this t-shirt. It's a little bit of like a Where's Waldo situation. Um, the, the whole like horizontal red and white stripe thing. But again, it's made from the same material as this hoodie. It's super soft. I can't get enough of it. And it's a v-neck t-shirt. Great for the summer. I mean that it is this kind of, I don't even know what this is. It's quite thick. I mean, in the summertime when it gets really hot, um, it wouldn't be one of my favorite t-shirts to wear only because it is very thick, but it's 100% cotton. Um, the white never turns yellow. Like, it never turns colors. That's the great thing about their t-shirts is that the quality, um, yeah, the white never changes colors. So, bless them for having that because I, I am totally like, you know, a fan, and I appreciate that. So, that's that. Anyhow, moving into... So, moving on to the Hong Kong pickups and all. Um, I don't know if you guys follow my blog, but you should if you don't, and if you do, thank you. Um, yeah, my blog, Inside the Milk Carton. I've actually blogged about this store before that's located in Hong Kong. It's called, um, Chocolate, but it's spelled Chocolate. And, um, I love the things that they produce. It's very esque, which is, um, a company produced by Ralph Lauren over here. They're young, they're fun, they're modern, they're, they're preppy-like, but they're also chic, you know? So, this is what they are. Black chocolate, type bittersweet taste, yada yada. And this is, um, a zip-up hoodie, but it's made of, like, um, like a chino material, like a khaki material. And it's been one of my all-time favorites since I've been back. I have been wearing it, so please excuse, like, the lint. I haven't really had a chance to lint it. But this is what it looks like. It's hooded. So that's what it is. And it looks great on. Let me, let me try it on for you guys. So it features, um, a double chest pocket in the front. It fits very preppy-like. It's not, 
you know, if you're looking for anything like super large or super baggy, that's not the case. They're a pretty well fitted company. So um, another thing that I love about this jacket is that it's a shirt sleeve. It has a button, features a button. Um, so you can actually, you know, unbutton and roll it up so it looks like a shirt with a hood. And this is what it looks like. Um, and it features, you know, the, the monogram skull print um, that looks very similar to rugby. That's why this brand is constantly reminding me of rugby. This is what it looks like. And it features two hoodie poles right here. And um, I've been rocking this a lot, actually. I, 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 I love it. I really do. Chocolate um, features constant newsletters that come out um, every now and then that show you, you know, like their products and all that. So this is actually available at the store. And these, I have in the laundry right now because I've been wearing them. I love them so much. Or like the trouser um, pants they we're offering. So this is the khaki, khaki one and this is the navy one of both which I've purchased. So they fold and um, there's a contrast like a seersucker um, print, like black and white print on the other side. And you can um, fold them up and you can wear them a little high rise or whatnot. So this is their black chocolate newsletter. These are the two that I've also purchased and brought home. They're currently in the laundry, so I can't show you. Sorry about that. And, um, yeah, they got some really neat stuff. Like, this is the, the way that they dress it to be. Um, the hoodie that I'm wearing right now, they also feature in a shirt, like a polo shirt right here. You see that? Polo shirt. Um... So it comes in a polo shirt version, and they do all these, like, t-shirts and, and such. And their t-shirt is um, very, very great material. It's, like, um, not a heavy cotton, but if you guys know about Super Dry or um, a little bit kind of like the Abercrombie & Fitch material, it's thicker cotton, not as thick as the ANF one, and not as, um, not as hard and uh, rough as the one that Super Dry uses, but great, amazing stuff. Um, here's the other side. And they're a lifestyle brand, so they create pretty much everything from outerwear to bottoms to totes to ties and all that sort of great stuff. And occasionally they'll do like a collaboration piece, which is like a centerpiece that they offer every season. So this one they did it with like, you know, things that um, represent Albert Einstein. So here were the fun things that they did for that concept. And then while I was there, they were doing like a switch over. So then... Here's the other one, which was more of like a varsity looking season. Um, I wasn't a fan of this this set of uh, collections, so I didn't purchase anything from here. But then they had, see, this one had is where they featured my hoodie. So that's the hoodie that I'm rocking right now. Same exact one. That's the newsletter. T-shirts and such. Book bags flannels, plaids, so forth. And they were doing one for Back in the Future, which is the the center focus for that season, for that changeover. So the Back to the Future stuff, they produce like, you know, the, the flight neck things, like where you, you know, you travel and you blow it up and you sleep and they had the eye patches, which was really cool. So this one, they... they were doing as I just gotten back um, to Hong Kong and they actually decked out their stores and did a whole vinyl wrap and all these crazy things. Um, so yeah, so that was chocolate. School, I didn't tell it so Cause no one was supposed to know no.